Because I clicked in a second ago. Do you guys don't remember? This one. Wait a minute. Nobody dies in there, right? Up in smoke. Drone footage gives a different vantage of the massive explosion that rocked the English city of Exeter over the weekend. The source was a German bomb dropped on the town 80 years ago. The weapon, known as a Hermann bomb, posed an unknown, unseen threat to Exeter, including the students at the University of Exeter. The one-ton device was uncovered by builders who were lucky to not accidentally detonate it. The discovery caused an evacuation around Exeter's city center as bomb teams worked to secure the old munition. They disposed of the threat with a controlled detonation. The sound of the blast echoed for miles. It sent debris hundreds of meters into the air and left behind a huge crater. Across Europe, unexploded bombs from both World War I and Jesus, World War II man. still pose a threat. In October of 2020, Boom. an old English bomb was detonated off the Polish coast. Earlier that year, a London neighborhood had to be evacuated after a bomb dating to the notorious Blitz raids was discovered. And in January of 2021, Four old World War II bombs were found and detonated in Lower Saxony in Germany. Even though these weapons are things of the past, they continue to endanger the present. That's pretty crazy. This is Inside Edition Digital. Oh, cool. Thanks. Did I see this yet? Nine Thanks. months. Thank you Uriah for everything. Westman. Can I be welcomed to the jungle? There no. <laughs> and then the final speaker will be Andrea Pullman. Hey, I'm Uriah. Uh, it was really awkward doing the Pledge of Allegiance because I'm Canadian, so I kind of went with it. <laughs> I did vote in the last election, even though I'm Canadian. I'm like, ah, let's see what happens. If, uh, if a Russian can vote, <laughs> why can I, right? Be from Canada, I'm not used to Look at the face of this guy under my camera. So it's just sitting there, you know, on the bench, sweating, sweating like a Republican applying for food stamps. I, I never have issues parking, I don't know. I feel weird, I can always park. I went down to Las Vegas to be part of the, you know, the blue man group. And then my car broke down. They say what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. In this case, it was my car, my dreams. Cause see, I had AAA, but you know I'm from <laughs> Canada, right? So I had the Canadian version. It's when three Canadians get out uh, and fight over who's gonna help you. Triple so A. Bad. <laughs> I've never had more respect for city council than what you guys probably are feeling right now with me talking. I am uh, American. I didn't commit voter fraud. That was a joke. Just, uh, just to clear things up with the gentleman in the back, the police officer. I work in the funk zone, and I hate it. Everyone asks me, is this the funk zone? Yes. This is terrible. Have any of you guys rode the Greyhound before? The Greyhound is the cards against humanity of travel. You just never know if you're going to get stabbed. Am I right? Ah. <laughs> I'm wasting my time thinking. People don't think anymore. I'm like a live Twitter feed at this point. You know what I mean? I was watching. No, I wasn't. Mr. Westman, thank you. That's so my much. time. Hey. No, that's it. <laughs> thank you, uh, Ms. Pullman. Yeah, he takes a pause and looks at everybody. If anybody's laughing, go on, dude. Months Bogu. I'm built differently, I'm built differently